Hey, what's up, YouTube? This is Team Carnage here with a review of my DLX Lux. Sorry, I've been meant to do it earlier, but I've been busy with work. Um, so let's get into it. This is uh, 1.0. I picked it up about two weeks ago from a sponsored player from Doodlebug Sports up in Everett, Washington. It's a really good place to go if you ever get a chance, if you're in western Washington, to get up there. They have an indoor and outdoor park. Um, real fun. Prices are pretty good too as well. But uh it's pewter and green. Um the original color was pewter and white. Uh I, um, I don't know if he did that when he gave when he sold it to me, put the d different colors on it, but uh when I bought it, it was already had the parts on it and you can see the serial number, the white special stand um, polished and pewter but uh, it looks pretty badass as green so let's just get into the, the seeing the gun I took out the barrel already because I'm using uh, one hand to film I put it together beforehand so there you go I intend to upgrade the bolt on this I have not had any bolt stick problems with the gun itself or first shot drop off even playing in the cold i've only been able to play a couple times because it's been like snowmageddon up here in washington so yeah i haven't really been out um and even if i do go out and play in the cold i don't take this out i usually play with my invert mini which seems to do really well and so yeah but anyways back to the lux it's a really awesome gun probably one of the best shooters i've had um you know, I love the eye covers. The eye covers just snap off. They don't have the screws to mess with, like the the 1.5s and 2.0s. But uh, French really, I like it. It's just easy snap off. I mean, a lot of people I see that use the Lux 1.0s, they put like a hair tie or a rubber band around the two eye covers, um, just so just for extra security. But uh, I I haven't had any problems with it. Um, the trigger that's on there right now is really smooth. Um, I shoot left-handed, um, which is really, I don't know, it doesn't really make a difference for a lot of people, but for me it's easier that way, and so I usually play left side. Um, the bolt, like I said, no problems. I haven't had any leaks. A lot of people have leaks inside the regulator in here or up back here, but uh, it's been perfect. It's always teched by Doodlebug, so whenever I have a problem or if I ever do encounter a problem, um, I will always take it there because they they do a really good job of fixing the kinks on it and I'm going to have them install the 2.0 power core, put the bolt in there for me and, and I'm going to upgrade the board as well to a 2.0 just because it's just newer technology, you know, I don't know the complete specs on the new board but uh, yeah, so I, I've heard it's really good things from Sorry. it and uh so 50%. yeah I need, firing to, mode, semi -automatic. I need to plug it in and uh get it get it charged up for hopefully this weekend if it's not raining to see the eye oh, backwards see the eyes on in there um and i like how inside the grips i have the breakaway grips on here it's really nice just peel open so you can play your uh you can change your modes up on the fly with the joystick right here, I don't know if you can see, it's kind of dark in here, but it's right there, it's a joystick. But um, it's really nice to have breakaway grips. A lot of them say, oh, you're gonna bend your grips, you're gonna break them and whatnot, but grips are cheap, so if I do end up breaking my grips, I can just go pick up another set, and it doesn't cost that much. So let me just put this on real quick for you. Let me show you what it looks like. And so, but yeah, that's there it is, all together in one piece. I would take out the bolt, but it's a uh, kind of a pain in the ass with um one hand. So maybe if I get my uh, friend when he comes to help me out next video, I can put it up here. I want to do a shooting video of this. Uh, uh, unfortunately, I'm in an apartment complex, so I have to go out to my parents where they have some land, or go to a field or some shit. But yeah, overall, this gun really nice really really fast and unbelievably smooth one of the smoothest guns like i said i've shot so yeah if you have any questions i'll just ask away i'll do the best i can to answer it um please rate comment subscribe uh thanks this is team carnage and uh
I'll be back with a shooting video a little bit later. Thanks.